I'm going to show you how to use the Van de Graaff generator. So I've assembled the Van de Graaff generator and I've plugged it in. So I've used the cable, plugged it into the power socket and the lights on at the moment. I then get my conducting stick and I'm going to plug the red end into the red socket on the Van de Graaff generator, which you can't quite see, but it's the red bit. I push that in. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to flick the switch that turns the Van de Graaff generator on and the belt starts to spin. If I want to make sparks, I just hold the conducting stick, which is this one here, close to the ball like this. If I hold it closer to the ball, I get small sparks. If I hold it further away, I get big sparks. I can do it all the way around the ball. Then I'm going to turn the Van de Graaff generator off. I'm going to put the conducting stick close to the ball and make sure there's no more charge. Now I'm going to try sticking somebody's hair up in the air. Come and have a go, Maggie. So I've got my stool, it's on the floor, and I'm going to say, Maggie, please can you stand up on the stool? And I'll check that there's no charge in the Van de Graaff generator. Please can you put your hands on the Van de Graaff generator? Then I'm going to switch the Van de Graaff generator off. I've got to make sure that I don't touch Maggie, because if I touch her, I'll get a shock, and she'll get a shock as well. Her hair is starting to stick up in the air. Can you give your head a bit of a shake from side to side? That just helps the hair to lift up a little bit more. Children's hair will tend to go a little bit better than adults' hair, because it won't be quite as thick. Give it another big shake from side to side, and then we could leave that there for a few minutes to give the hair a chance to go up in the air. When we're finished, keep your hands on. Don't take your hands off yet. I'm going to turn the Van der Graaff generator off. Still keep your hands on until I've put the conducting stick next to the ball and all of the child's hair will come back down again. It's now safe for them to take their hands off and they can step down from the stool. Thank you very much. If they take their hands off too early, all it means is that the child is still charged up. So they might go and touch somebody really, really quickly and give them a static shock. It's not dangerous if they do that, but to stop them being able to do that, if they've forgotten to leave their hands on and they've jumped off, get them to touch the floor with their hands and it will take all the charge out of them. And that's how you use the Van de Graaff generator.